I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Cougars. Today is Wednesday, May 23rd. Welcome to SCTV News. I'm Nico Slater. And I'm Caleb Kaiser. Senior exhibitions wrap up tomorrow after school. We'll have a minimum day to make time for presentations. Today is the last day to buy prom tickets. The cost is $55 and only cash or credit will be accepted. In addition, we are in the middle of a spirit week. Tomorrow, you should pair up with another student and Friday, everyone should wear neon. Today is the last day to buy cougar gear at the student store, so if you'd like to represent Steel Canyon this summer, make those purchases now. Also, the last day to buy yearbook is this Friday. You can reserve yours at the finance office. Your first chance to get a yearbook is next Thursday night in the gym, but they will not be distributed at school until the following Monday, June 4th. There's a mandatory meeting for all dodgeball players today at lunch in the ASB room. There's lots of important info to share, so be there today. Also, dodgeball tickets are on sale. The cost is $5 and you can pick them up at the student store. Dodgeball is tomorrow night in our gym. A big thank you to all of the Steel Canyon staff and students who turned out for the Mido 5K Superhero Run Walk. It was a huge event last weekend with hundreds of participants. Mrs. Whaley was a key organizer of the event and she was thrilled by how it turned out. Uh, it was amazing. It was our best uh, event ever. We had the highest attendance that we've ever had in the six years that we did it. We had 10 news come and do an interview and do a whole little clip on the event. Uh, it was so great. It was really organized and we had 65 Steel Canyon students come and volunteer. So it went amazing. Well, that, that day is the most emotional, most exciting, exhilarating day of my life. Um, seeing all of our supporters together in one place, standing before me when I give my thank you speech, like it's, I just look around and it makes me feel so incredibly loved and um, it makes me feel so good and it just helps my day to day. It gives me energy for an entire year to continue fighting for my daughters. This event is important because um, my first set, um, we lost him at age two to mitochondrial disease and we've been coming since the first event. Um, it's important to raise money to help other families and kids. I want to say thank you because the more money we raise, the more research they can do and hopefully find um, some type of cure or some way to help these kids live longer lives. I see a cure. I expect miracles and um, I do. I definitely expect a cure. I expect that UCSD is going to be the one to find it. Um, we have very dedicated scientists that are working diligently uh, to find a cure. Or treatment and um, they love my daughters they love all their patients and they're and it shows I mean they're passionate and they're loving and caring and they're the most amazing doctors I've ever met in my life and it's um, I know that they're gonna be the ones to find the care so we're at a really exciting stage at the moment there's uh, uh, a number of drug companies yeah. that are coming up with treatments for mitochondrial disease and we're in the middle of figuring out if they work this is a great event uh, and uh, it, it's really helping the research and it's also getting a lot of people together um, and uh, the patients and families are having a great time so this is really important to raise the awareness of, uh, of mitochondrial disease. Mitochondrial disease is rare and so the big pots of money that are uh, available for more common diseases like Alzheimer's and Parkinson's disease are not available for mitochondrial disease. And so every little bit of money helps a lot to move this forward. So it's really important. Thanks to all of the students who applied for next year's ASB class. Also, a big thanks to all of the staff members who took time to write recommendations for all of the applicants. The ASB leadership will be sending out acceptance and rejection letters starting June 1st. 
Tonight is the opening night for the Steel Canyon Dance and Show Choir Spring Concert. It will be a special night because it is Mrs. Gurner's farewell show. Curtain time is 7 p.m. and the theater will be full, so plan to get here early. The Blood Mobile is headed back to Steel Canyon next Thursday. You can sign up to donate blood today at lunch. If you're hungry after school, head to the front of the school. The class of 2019 will be selling Tosta Locos for $2. That's all the news we have for you today. Have a great week. Raw Raw Cougars. Cougar Pride. Get, Get some. some.